How do I create a form in Outlook? Imagine you need to send out a standard email template to your team or clients, but you want to customize it to fit your specific needs. Creating a custom form in Outlook can make this process much easier. To start, you need to access the Developer tab. If you don't see it, you can add it by right-clicking on any of the ribbon commands, selecting Customize the ribbon, and then checking the box next to Developer and clicking OK. Once you have the Developer tab, click on Design a Form in the Custom Forms group. Here, you'll select the standard form that you want to base your custom form on. For example, if you're creating a custom email template, you would select the standard mail message form. Next, you'll customize the form by adding the fields, controls, and code that you need. You can use the field chooser to see all the available fields for the type of item you're working with. For instance, if you're working on an email message, you can click All Mail Fields to see all the fields available. After customizing your form, you'll need to set the form attributes. This involves defining how the form will behave and what data it will collect. Finally, you need to publish the form. To make the custom form available, you must publish it to a folder. If you want the form to be available to other users, publish it to a public folder. If it's just for personal use, you can publish it in a personal folder. If you want your custom form to be the default when you hit the new email button, you'll need to publish the form to the personal forms library and then set it as the default form for new emails. However, this can be a bit tricky as you might need to adjust settings to ensure it appears every time you create a new email. By following these steps, you can create and use custom forms in Outlook to streamline your email communication.